What's going on guys? Renegade here with you. I'm here with another video. My voice is kind of a little messed up. I'm a little under the weather, but hey, I got something crazy to show y'all. Well, not really crazy, but really neat, really cool. So as you know, if you watched the last video or two videos ago, three videos ago or something, I sold Blade, the black 2020 Renegade. And uh, yeah, so, you know, we already bought something new. Um, oh, whoops. I didn't mean to show you that fast. Look at that cloud. That's pretty neat. I'm in the clouds. Um, but, oh, oh. <sighs> crap crap but it's pretty stock right now this four that i bought but guess what it is a 2024 renegade y'all look at this thing right here i uh, know foot was on it i already took them off but i figured i'd uh show y'all a little bit of what i bought the aztecs are actually mine um this is actually the same guy that bought blade from me and i bought blade from originally which is the guy I sold it to which is long story but uh <coughs> yeah so i got my slg already on there too but anyways i sold a lot of parts off of this to put on 2020s so i could keep my own parts um but yeah we got a 2024 that we just we well, actually haven't bought yet but we're about to buy and i'm about to put a bunch of stuff on it we're going to bogs in a couple weeks so yeah i'm gonna show y'all what i'm gonna put on it and uh yep titus titus is gonna be there too though titus is a beast but uh yeah this is the 2024 it's got 32 inch aztecs on it got the slg like i said stock clutches right now but i'm about to show y'all what i'm put on it um it will eventually get the nitrous that was on blade not yet, not for bugs. Um, maybe for Halloween at bugs, but I'll probably have to get it put on a dyno again. So yeah, we're about to get started on that in a few minutes. I gotta take my trash in the road. But yeah, uh, I'll show you how the parts I'm put on. Getting that 2024 all cleaned up. <sighs> well, y'all, we may have bought this thing. Um, it's not, we'll let this for long, but uh, yeah, yeah, it's gonna be beautiful. So yeah, I'm gonna put these footwells on it. Y'all check out 24-7 mud. I love these things. He makes them, he'll send them out, get you a set. I'll put these two inch spacers in there. Um, that back rack without the nitrous, cause yeah, I gotta hook it up, but it's, that bottle's got something in it. But uh, I am going to put uh, those tie rods on it, that belt, uh, clutches, QSC. Uh, Y'all know, get with QSC, man. That's the best clutch ever in the world. QSC RMT. Um, yeah. RevX. RMT one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways, SDM secondary. Um, some little odds and ends. And yeah. So all that's going to go on 2024. I'm not sure which tires I'm putting on there yet. I'll probably put this sort of video because it's going to look better with size snares on it. Of course, Bullet Wheels. Y'all use my code Renegade10, gets you a uh, 10% off of those wheels. Best wheels in the game. They are amazing. But I might put these out law max on it. But guess what? Bullet wheels again. Check them out. Renegade 10. We're probably gonna ride these. I mean, uh, put these on it for bugs. That way I have these and the Naders, their own Titus. So we see how the tires compare to bugs, because I've yet to ride those. Oh, focus. Focus. Ride these at bugs. And uh, I'm ready to see how they do there. Cause they actually impressed me. I actually think they may be better naders. I mean, they're 33s and they really outperform 34 naders. Naders have a specific mud type that they're really, really good in. And besides that, they're not that great. Um, really thick stuff. They don't climb out of holes though very well. But yeah, let's get these clutches put on this today. Um, oh yeah. Now this is kind of sad, but it's got the 2020 radiator in it. So it's a little beat up. But you know, it's whatever. I put that 24 because I took the radiator kit off of this one, put it on blade. Y'all will see that, and we already seen that in the last video, probably. Uh, Southern Ridge, because uh, we went road Southern Ridge, 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 Southern Ridge, uh, Southern Ridge. It was a blast. But yeah, let's get these things put on because uh, that's what this video is about building the 24, even though we're not doing too much yet. Uh, but yeah, I'm excited. I hope y'all are excited. We'll get some crazy content with a 23 and a 24 now. And uh, eventually, hopefully, you get a side by side, but we'll see about that. So, yeah, I keep rambling on. Uh, I ain't talked much all day because I've been kind of sick feeling, and it feels good out here. So, uh, yeah, let's get going. The stock clutch is about to be gone. QSC STM, let's go. And I sealed the back of the build box, so hopefully, it don't leak. Let's get it. First upgrades. Well, y'all, we got the clutches on. Uh, probably got to go eat. And then we'll put tires on and maybe the footwells. 
Probably won't get to the tie rods, but yeah, let's get it. All right, y'all, we're about to throw on the 34s, see what she looks like. That's with 32s, no spacers. We'll put on two inch spacers and the 34s. And then we'll change it to those LL Maxes before the ride in two weeks. We got the Naders on the 24. Look at them wheels. Woo! I know I can't get a good view of it in here. I still gotta put the foils on, but woo! I think it'll be sick. Well, y'all, got the SLG little piece right here. I don't know what it's called, but that will stay on there. Got the foot wells, 24 7 mud. Check them out, get them. Great foot wells. Kind of lift your fenders a little bit, make your foot a little taller. But yeah, beast. Let's get it. Hi, right, y'all. We got the Renegade Special snorkel cover on here. Send it, baby. Um, yeah, so after that, we're gonna put on these tie rods, best in the game, specialized ATV. Um, if you ain't running these, you need to be. We'll take off some stock ones, probably put the stock ones on 23 because we stole it. And uh, yeah, or something else, we'll see. But uh, need to get that thing back where it's movable. So yeah, I can start working on it. But uh, yeah, we'll put these on right now. Hopefully finish this tonight. And then that may be it for, well, no. May, start, may put it back rack home first. Um, yeah, and then that'll be it. Oh, no, never mind. Never mind. There's always something else. So I got some uh, tail lights coming and some hand grips coming, but they're not here yet. So we'll put them on next week. And then we might have something special for y'all later on, but uh, for now, it's just going to be the back rack. Yep, so we got to take the bottle off for now. All right, well, I got the Rough Country back rack on it. Probably gonna end up putting the Outlaw Maxes on Titus since I'll be on it the most this weekend. I really want to try them at Boggs and we're gonna leave the Bullite wheels on the 24. We still gotta put these tire rods on. So yeah, let's do that now. Well, y'all, we got the specialized ATV tire rods on the girl. I guess it's a girl. I don't know. I come up with a name. No idea yet. No idea. All right, y'all. Well, it's a new day, and we are still working on 2024. Today, we are going to uh, change the oil and then change the wind trip up front. We might change the fair lead. Um, yeah. But uh, that's about it today. And I think she should be ready for bogs. And then after that, we're going to put some upgrades on her. And uh, we already put upgrades on her already. But we're going to put some more upgrades on her. And uh, yeah. We were going to go to the beach that weekend for a vacation because I didn't take a vacation like all summer besides riding. So, yeah. But uh, for now, to end this video off, we're going to change the oil and then we're going to take some pictures, make a little video, make an intro video probably, and then probably still throw it in at the end. Take some videos with Titus and this one on the both of the side standards. And then we're going to put the LL Maxes on Titus for the weekend, next weekend. Not this weekend, about to go to a wedding in a little while. So, hopefully, get this all done, finished up, ready to ride. Got a little work to do to tie this. I'm gonna check some things out, make sure it's ready to go because I haven't checked this since last ride. And you gotta do that after every ride because uh, you don't wanna break down on the weekend. So yeah, let's do it. And uh, then we'll start putting a motor in this one. Already rebuilt it. Well, it's a brand new motor, but we'll put a big board kit on it and it's gonna be nasty. But yeah, let's get rolling on this. I went ahead and decided we were gonna give this thing a full service. Yep, then did the motor, spill some oil the transmission and now we are at the rear diff. Rear diff looks, oh, oh, it's good. See, see, that's why I get away everywhere. But uh, motor looks awesome. Transmission looks all right. It, uh, I couldn't tell if it had anything in it or not, but it may have been the first time it was changed, so I don't know. But uh, rear diff looks perfect. Front diff, I ain't got to it yet. Gonna take the skip blade off and I'm gonna leave it off because uh, bump that skip blade. So yeah, and then I'm gonna take the spark plug boots off, grease them and then I think that'll be it. Old girl will be ready. We gotta come up with a name. Y'all think of a name. Think of a name. Come on. Y'all, this is why you check your stuff before you go ride. Like, what? The factory? What? Fail. Oh, well. That's why you check it. Oh, uh, y'all, this thing has turned out sick. Got the new uh, synthetic rope winch. Well, same winch, but synthetic rope put on. Yeah, you can see it right there. Got a black hook. Um, what else did I do? Oh, complete service all the way around. Oil look good. Um, 
put dollar degrees on spark plugs hopefully that's all good hoping no leaks um we will be testing it out next weekend and yeah i got some uh hand grips that just came in today and i got some tail lights on the way should be in this week so i'll put both of those in and that'll be it beast uh, i gotta just adjust this tire rod just a little bit because the tire is pointed in and kind of goes to the, that way but yeah all right y'all well i'm here with a finished 2024 renegade this thing has turned out absolutely sick i'm gonna take some pictures of it right here but uh, i want to let y'all know what all we did so we got the 34 inch sassinators with bullet wheels um what else we got here we got odi grips you gotta put the grips on it you gotta be able to hold on don't want to fly off these things these things are powerful you got a rough country rear rack eventually something else will be on the rear rack with it but not before this ride um stock tail lights but i got some tail lights coming that's the only thing that ain't done yet um but it'll be done this week and i'm gonna go ahead and get this video out um let's see slg exhaust slip on exhaust sounds absolutely nasty let's crank it up QSC slash STM clutches on it, QSC primary. Uh, it's the RMT uh, Rev X clutch. It is absolutely, it's the best clutch there is. So y'all get some videos of it. Yeah. It's on Titus right now. Um, I had it on my black Renegade that had the nitrous and it was absolutely ni uh, nitrous. See, I'm thinking nitrous. Hmm. Absolutely nasty. Um, I serviced the whole thing. What else did we do? Oh, specialized ATV tie rods, best in the business put a synthetic rope winch on it and yeah that's about it uh we're taking out the bogs and boulders next weekend and gonna test it out see what it does see how the 2024 compares to 2023 old titus is coming too but uh we're gonna put different tires on titus we're gonna take the pictures with them both side by side because they look absolutely nasty but uh that's gonna be it for this video so i'll catch you on the next one renegade out